Good morning, kiddos. I have an activity for you today. It's going to re require a little bit of uh, creativity and crafting. Um, so let me turn my camera around. All right, so I have a box that I cut a hole in. I have, I happen to have a dryer ball because it's light. If you have another kind of ball, it needs to be light. Um, or you can use a piece of paper rolled up into a ball. That's fine. And this is what you're going to need to take some thinking to make. This is just a mallet. Okay. So I happen to have a yardstick. Uh, mine is made out of metal and a toilet paper roll. You got to cover up the end and attach it somehow to a stick of some kind. You could go outside and get a stick too. That would be fine. Um, what you are going to do is play kind of like a, uh, like a croquet game or something. You can set it up outside or in the driveway. It might be better someplace that's not windy because the ball is so light. And the reason the ball needs to be so light is because your mallet is not going to have a lot of weight behind it. It's, my mallet is pretty light. Um, it's hollow. There's no force behind it. And it's on a wobbly stick. But that means I got to be very, very precise in how I'm hitting this ball. So you want to, see if I can do this with one hand, you want to try to hit the ball and get it into the hole that you've cut into your box, like so. Oh, and I made it. Nice. Double check. Apparently I didn't. Double check that your hole is big enough for your ball to fit through. All right, so I think I'm going to need to make my ball or my hole just a little bit bigger in order for my ball to fit through. What you could also do is put several holes, turn to the other side, put some holes, maybe put two holes here, um, and you could number them for points and make a game out of it with your siblings. All righty, have a wonderful, beautiful day.